military service. The Army is part of the Department of the Army, which is one of the three military departments of the Department of Defense. The U.S. Army is headed by a civilian senior appointed civil servant, the Secretary of the Army, S-E-C-A-R-M-Y, and by a Chief Military Officer, the Chief of Staff of the Army, C-S-A, who is also a member of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. In the fiscal year 2017, the projected end strength for the regular Army, USA, was 460,000 soldiers. The Army National Guard, ARNG, had 335,000 soldiers, and the United States Army Reserve, USAR, had 195,000 soldiers. The combined component strength of the U.S. Army was 990,000 soldiers. 3. As a branch of the armed forces, the mission of the U.S. Army is to fight and win our nation's wars by providing prompt, sustained land dominance across the full range of military operations and the spectrum of conflict in support of combatant commanders. 9. The branch participates in conflicts worldwide and is the major ground-based offensive and defensive force of the United States. Mission Edit The United States Army serves as the land-based branch of the U.S. Armed Forces. Section 3062 of Title 10, U.S. Code defines the purpose of the Army as 10-11. Preserving the peace and security and providing for the defense of the United States, the Commonwealths and possessions and any areas occupied by the United States. Supporting the national policies, implementing the national objectives, overcoming any nations responsible for aggressive acts that imperil the peace and security of the United States. History Edit Main article, History of the United States Army. This article a section may need to be cleaned up or summarized because it has been split from to History of the United States Army. Origins edit. Storming of Redoubt No. 10 in the siege of Yorktown during the American Revolutionary War prompted the British government to begin negotiations, resulting in the Treaty of Paris and British recognition of the United States of America. The Continental Army was created on the 14th of June 1775 by the Continental Congress 12 as a unified army for the colonies to fight Great Britain, with George Washington appointed as its commander. 6, 13, 14, 15. The army was initially led by men who had served in the British Army a colonial militias and who brought much of British military heritage with them. As the Revolutionary War progressed, French aid, resources, and military thinking influenced the new army. A number of European soldiers came on their own to help, such as Friedrich Wilhelm von Steuben, who taught Prussian army tactics and organizational skills. The army fought numerous pitched battles and in the south in 1780-81 sometimes used the Fabian strategy and hit and run tactics, hitting where the British were weakest to wear down the forces. Washington led victories against